Hi everyone, it's Neil from Neil's Reef Aquarium. Uh, so it's it's a bit like Groundhog Day today. So uh, uh, we're back at Reef Dreams. Uh, if you watched the previous video, you would have seen what happened with the goby. He uh, he must have somehow got out of the t uh, the tank, uh, even though I've got a lid, and he's um, he jumped out basically. So uh, we're we're off to get another one today, and uh, yeah, we'll uh, go and get him, and then we'll we'll, we'll come home and. Um, We'll, we'll get them in the tank, so uh, I'll speak to you in a bit. Hi everyone, so I'm back from Reef Dreams and uh, we've got uh, another goby. This one, it's um, I, I made a mistake on the last one, it wasn't actually this isn't what I had last time. I put on the I, I think the, the thumbnail has got the, is this one, the high fin one, but mine was slightly different. I, I've and I looked in the uh, in my book and it was a slightly different one I got last time, but this is the actual one I wanted, so um, um, but yeah, yeah, this little fella looks amazing. He's uh, I'd say he's probably a little bit bigger, not much more bigger than the other one. So there is that risk that he can um, go through the the uh, the mesh again, but uh, it's a risk you've got to take. I've been going just a bit of bad luck that time, but um, so we're going to let him acclimate for uh, about thirty, twenty, twenty, thirty, twenty minutes to thirty minutes, and then we're um, we'll get him in the tank. Uh, but whilst we're let's just have a little quick look at the uh, the tank this week. Um, so just got a little update whilst he's acclimating. So uh, yeah, I mean I'm really happy at the moment. The the colours of the the zoas are really coming out. They're popping like anything. They're they're, they're all opening. They're growing as well. As you know, I'm starting to see new new part you know heads each day on the on the zoas. Um, that was one head. That one there and that's uh the candy apples that was uh that was probably my that's my most expensive coral bought so far but there was only a few of them and they've grown i don't know if you can see the rasters at the back there they've uh they've got they've doubled in in heads um i'm not sure what that other one is uh but yeah the hammer there is uh don't seem to be growing that much but um it's uh see it's seems happy but uh, there's not much growth on that one um then we got one of the torches there he seems to be nice and fluffy which is good and the other one up there uh but i haven't actually bought any new corals because um i would just like to have a look at them face to face really um and i know you can there's uh the groups that you can what you see is what you get but i, I just a bit better fashion like to have a look at them which is why i hardly ever buy i think i've bought one zoa online and that's it um but my acan's looking all right uh nice and fluffy look as it before favia um yeah i didn't really done much it looks the same as when I bought it, so uh, maybe it's in the wrong place. Um, but yeah, open to comments on that one. Um, this was a zoa my miss my missus picked out, and I think it was two heads on it at the time, and that's really come into life. And uh, again, there was what ten head, at least ten heads on that one. Um, uh, jungle juice, or f I think it's called that one. That's one of my favourites at the front there. And my first ever coral, the LA Lakers. Um, uh, so yeah, um, the tank's looking really good. All the pro I've done my test today. All the parameters are, are perfect. Uh, alkalinity is a bit low, seven. I think it's seven or seven point five. So you know, I'll be dosing manually dosing some of that in the week. Um, uh, but yeah, the fish, um, obviously the light, lights have just come on, so they're all a bit hiding at the moment. But uh, cleaner shrimps seem to be getting bigger and bigger, which is good. They keep shedding. Um, starfish, there, still grazing away. The mandarin, I've seen, seen the mandarin this morning. Um, it's uh, one of the peppermint shrimps there. Now, one good thing, I don't want to tempt fate at the moment, but I haven't seen any Aptasia this week. So maybe, just maybe, they're starting to eat it, which would be amazing if that is the case. It's the grammar. The grammar's getting fat, actually, which is good. There's my little bike killer, Blenny. Um, you love him. He's got such such good character to him. Um, uh, he's, he's, he's always hiding and he'll pop out. And then... Uh, 
the tang. Tangs are so shy. My, my tang is the shyest tang. You put a, a clip in of Nori and he won't go near it. Um, he's just scared of the clip. So, uh, but the mastic I've bought recently, um, let me just get this, show you this stuff here. Um, this stuff is, uh, it comes all in little things. You just squidge it stick it onto the glass and he, he, they, he absolutely loves that stuff so uh, I saw that on another uh, reefers video uh, on YouTube and I thought I'll get some of that and yeah my, my tang loves that so uh, um, there's another peppermint shrimp there hopefully they are looking for the uptages fingers crossed that'd be amazing if that is the case because um, as you know from previous videos I was you know, riddled with it last week I, I had a sump clean out cleaned the uh skimmer i done all the maintenance on the skimmer and uh that was riddled with aptasia so uh i've cleaned it literally cleaned up from spent a few hours doing that and that's now looking uh spot on um so we just come out you can see the clowns there <laughs> they, they, they they were growing quite a bit they don't seem to grow much more now but clowns don't even grow much bigger than that um uh so yeah you know we're you know really happy with the tank at the moment it's uh obviously it's looking nice today because I've, I've done all uh, I, I vacuum the gravel every week it's just part of my uh when i'm doing the water change i just think why not i like it nice looking nice and white so uh so yeah i do that um uh like i said a few of the pilot you know the gsp hasn't come out yet it's uh, a bit early for them uh so uh, maybe we should have done a, a proper update when uh when the, the lights are on properly but uh they just started ramping up they come on at one um and i don't know what the time is now it's yeah it's 145 so it's been on 45 minutes um so yeah what i'll do so i'll pop, come back in a bit and we'll get the little fella in let's have another quick look at her him or her i don't know i forgot to ask this time uh she looks very feisty i hope she's not going to jump can't be that unlucky, surely. I just got to be very careful now when I take the lid off because last time when I was, you know, putting the copia pods in, the other one even could have jumped out then, when, and I didn't notice it because it was dark. So I've got, I don't put my, I've got ten packs of copia pods, and I'll, I'll put them all in, but I won't put them in until the, this evening when the lights are off. So they've got more chance of uh, not getting eaten. So I want the man, they're there really for the mandarin, not for the others to eat. So, uh, so yeah, but yeah, you look at it looking cool all right i'll be back in a bit and then we'll uh we'll get the little fella in all right see you in a bit right everyone i'm back so uh been acclimated now for well actually over an hour so uh more than enough time so uh time to get the little fella in so uh as usual i will hand over to one of my daughters who's gonna film and then we're gonna get the little fella in so there he is oh he looks a bit feisty, this one. Oh, I've got a feeling he's going to have a jumper in. I hope not. Right, so, the little fella's in. So what we're going to do is get him into the net. Hopefully he doesn't jump. Don't jump. Please don't jump. Come on. Come on. No, it's not. She don't want to come. Does she? Come on. Stay, stay right at the bottom so I can't get underneath. <laughs> come on, let's get, get you into the net. There we are. Right. Right, so we're, in the, we're into the net. So the secret now is to make sure she just doesn't jump. There we go. There she goes. Look at that. Oh, hiding spot straight away. So thank you, Martina. Um, so yeah, she's found a little spot to hide. Um, but she's in. I'm going to get that lid on straight away. Uh, so uh, so that's really it for the update for, for now. Um, uh, please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And we're at 30 subscribers so far. So for a new channel, that's not bad. So I just want to say thank you to everyone that's subscribed. 
Um, don't forget to hit the, uh, the bell notification because when I do get an, uh, when I do upload, you'll get a notification. You see, so you won't miss anything. Uh, but lots of content coming, and uh, we'll do another update soon on see how the Gobi's getting on, and hopefully he finds my pistol shrimp, and we can get another uh, little paired relationship again. So, uh, okay, yeah, thanks very much, and uh, we'll speak soon. Bye.